What's going on, SK followers? Today, I am back with another video for you guys today. We are going to be playing Game Dev Tycoon. This game isn't new, but I kind of want to try it out. I did play a bit, just to have a gist of it. So, to make things fair, we're going to make a new game. And, I didn't see much. I didn't really get to do a lot, but let's do this. Welcome to Game Dev Tycoon in this business simulation. You will, you have been transported back in time to start your very own game development company right at the beginning of the PC revolution. Yes, we're going that far back before Microsoft even decided to make an Xbox, before Sony was e even on the map, before Nintendo even made the NES. We're going back to that. And it's going to be far, far into the past. Oh my goodness. PC? The first PC games. This is going to be interesting. In the next 35 years, you can build your dream company. Create best-selling games. Gain fans. Become the, lead, the leader of the market. Before you can start your venture, you have to give your upcoming company a name. So automatically, I'm just going to make a Games of the Future again. There we go. Games of the future. Even though our games might be crap, we are still going to try. Um. That looks nice. I don't really have a name for him, though. We're going to name him Ken. Ken the Creator. Alright, here we go. Let's do this. Okay. I'm excited to play this with you guys to show you what this actually is if you haven't seen it you're you're in for a treat this game is actually pretty good congratulations you've just started your very own game development company at the moment your office is in the garage and you are the only employee but don't worry many successful businesses have started out this way let's start developing your first game close this menu and then tap anywhere on the screen to bring up the action menu let's do it all right so we're going to develop a new game. This is going to be our first game. But I kind of want to pick a topic first. What topics do we have? Disaster, horror, fashion, dance. What? I had to pick horror. Night of the Living Dead. That sounds like a terrible game. I would probably not play it. Um, only because I'm not really into that many horror games. Uh, but I can get into a couple. Some are actually pretty good, but others are pretty trash. Alright, so we're going to do this as, I think, a strategy game. I mean, I don't really want it to be an action game, to be honest with you. Horror games are more strategy, right? I mean, yeah. Something like that. Okay, so we have the G64, which I guess thing is the Commodore 64. And we have the PC, which is... The PC. So, we're going to choose PC. But should we? I want to start with the big market first. I feel like that would be a good start. Alright, there we go. This. We want it to be that. You've already spent a bunch of money. Jeez. Alright, so... The story needs to be good if it's a horror game. So that's the gameplay. The engine doesn't really matter, however. I feel like the story... Like, really matters in this. Let's be real. Your story kind of matters when you're in these type of games. Alright. Um. I guess. The artificial intelligence has to be good if it's a horror game. Uh. Does the level design really matter, to be honest? I don't think the dialogue really matters, however. There we go. I'm not real sure where I'm going to go with this. We're already doing basic. We'll design graphics, sound. Let's turn down that for uh, graphics. And then we're going to do that. Hopefully that is okay. Ooh. Now I did uh, listen to the person. They said that that was not an okay thing to try. Uh, to do the bugs, because those are bad. The orange things. You want those to be zero. So let's do this. 
We doing well? Okay, uh... We can do that. Okay. The first reviews for our newly released game, Night of the Living Dead, has come out. Let's see what they got. What? Bin material? Pretty bad. Uninspiring. Waste of money. Dang. Did all of these come from IGN? What the heck? Uh Yeah. Yeah. Mm. So we can research some stuff as well. Sci-fi. That's definitely one I want to research cuz those are like superhero games. You already know where I'm going with this. Uh Come on, are you for real? Sonic 06 gained more units than that. Jeez. We have zero fans from this. <laughs> we barely gained any fans. Uh, let's do. Ew. What do we got? Uh, dance till you're dead. I know that's like a meme song. I think, but I'm gonna do it anyway. Till needs to be capitalized, and dance is spelled wrong. Gosh dang it, SK. All right, there we go. Dance till you're dead. That that's the perfect thing. Of course, it has to be a strategy game. What else could it be? I guess it could be a simulation of dancing, but I mean, I don't, I don't think that's what they are really. Ooh, I don't think I want to go for the. Let's try the PC. I don't know how this will go. I'm actually pretty nervous about this one. This <laughs> is. I'm not gonna lie with you. The story doesn't matter. It's all about the gameplay and the engine. Story can just go down there. There we go. Uh, I don't know how I feel about this. I don't know how I feel about this. Dialogue does not matter one bit. Let's be real. It's a dancing game. <laughs> the artificial intelligence needs to be okay, I guess. There we go. Wow. Okay. I don't know why I'm doing so bad with these. Jeez. The graphics matter. The world design doesn't matter. The sound matters. It's a dancing game. You kind of need the sound to be a bit good. So, yeah. Alright. <sighs> Shoot. I could use a bit of tips. I'm not real sure how I'm going to do a dancing game. Can I just wait? Yay. Oh, fudge. Now the living dev is off the market. It barely gained any money. Look at the money we have now. No! I don't, I don't like this. No! Oh my gosh. Not fun. Waste of money. We're doing terrible. That's why I don't like these type of games. It's the reason I don't play Just Dance. You know what? We can't even make a new game. Budge. Because we're doing so bad. Why are we doing so bad? Time travel. That's perfect. Start research. Research that topic, and we will do it for the next game. Uh, wait, what? Recent market studies suggest that the Godorv G64 steadily outselling competitors in the PC. All right, all right. Experts say that this might sell spell the end. Uh, no. All right. It will not do that. Not at all. Have we done it? Yes. Uh, what do we do? <laughs> We're gonna go bankrupt. As simple as that. We've already had two bad games. We need to have a blockbuster. We need this to be good. We need time travel on our side. 
Uh, what should we name it? Mm. Time Saver. This is the worst game I've ever had. No, the worst game is probably the Just Dance one. Jeez. It's going to be an action game. You have to save time from the evil monsters. Do we even have enough money for this? <laughs> no, we don't. Now we're in the negatives. Eek. I don't like this. Story matters. So does the engine. Which one matters more? Uh, it's an action game. I don't think it needs too much story. Just put that down. Uh, jeez. What? No! We're going bankrupt. This is not okay. The level design really matters. The dialogue knows so much. And artificial intelligence... Not that much. Oh, no. Please let me do good with this one. Nintendo is planning to launch its very own home gaming console. Nintendo is known for the widely successful arcade game, Dinky King. Many industry experts doubt that the home, the home gaming consoles would take off. But we are eager to see what Nintendo would deliver. Oh, this, is being, this is actually good. We need this to be a blockbuster hit. With the kids, so uh, yeah, we need to be have good graphics. Uh, the sound doesn't need to be much. I want this to succeed really bad. Ooh, that's good. That's very good. Yes, that's really good. Please don't let this be bad. No! Look at our money! Uh, oh no. Did we do good? Did we do good? Oh no. Yes! Okay. We did okay. Oh no. Have seen better. Come on, man. Show us potential. Please, buy my game. Buy it, please. Oh, uh, shit. Please give us some money. Wow. Ooh! Oh, we got some fans now! Finally, it's about time. Good job. Hey. I've just finished Time Saver and I'm impressed by your talent. Okay, so this is where we can do contract work. Finally. We need some money. Uh, do this. Hey, look at our money! Yes! Buy our game! It's very good, and it has good graphics. Today, Nintendo has confirmed recent rumors and announced their plans to release a new homing game console called TES. Or if you're living under a rock, my boy, that's the NES, the Nintendo Entertainment System. Early next year, the console features cartridge-based games and a uniquely designed controller. Okay. Done. Yes. With hire again, we will transfer 12000 to your account. What's this? You successfully... Okay. Alright. We're gonna make another game. We got this. We got this. Um... Let's see what we got. I believe that we should go... For disaster game. There we go. Oh, shoot. That's good. Um, a simulation. I don't know. Yes. Th that will do. Quirky, but good. Yes. See, I'm learning. Their focus on graphics served this game very well. I've seen better. You're probably a Sonic he the Hedgehog player, aren't you? Alright, come on, let's do this. Yes! 
Come on, finish your contract work. We don't want to lose. Wait, what? Today, new game platform TES by Nintendo has been released. Yes. Now we can make the game I really want to make. Thank you for taking care of this for us. Yes. We have money. So now we can pick sci fi. I'm already picking a platform. Yes. Yes. An action game. And you already know what it's going to be. That is right. You knew this game was about to be made on this. You knew it. You knew it was going to happen. Oof. This better be a blockbuster hit. <laughs> oh my gosh. This better be a good game. Or I am telling you, this is not going to be good for us. Oh no. This better be good. This better be good. Uh, do that. I mean, that's fine. Right? Yeah, that's okay. I thought we were going to get more from that. <laughs> oh, oh, there we go. That's what I like to see. All right. The sound matters. The graphic design could be somewhere over here. Sound and graphic all the way up. And there we go. Is that good? No? Yes? Maybe? Yes? Is this our new best? Is this our new best? It's our new best. It's our new best. Get those bugs out. Get those bugs out. Get those bugs out. Let's go. Ooh. Yes. All right. This might be my favorite game we have made because it might be our best. Research topic. We have enough money to research. We have enough to do the custom game engine. So we'll do that. Since we're not doing much. Ooh, that did well. Uh-oh, here come the reviews for the SK Team video game. I hope everybody liked it. Mm. Ooh. Nintendo, do you see this right now? Do you see this right now? I I just made the first TNS game. The SKT video game, and it already is a blockbuster hit. Not even a blockbuster hit. Everyone's going to buy that game. Everyone's going to rent it from Redbox, and people even use that anymore. But it's back when the Nintendo was, like, just starting out. So I guess Redbox either didn't exist or was new. I don't know. I'm not going to look it up. Yes. Oh, my goodness. You see this, Nintendo. That just goes to show that your next E3... We could be seeing the SK Team video game. Alright. So we're getting a lot of money, but right now we are researching something. And we're getting a lot of fans from the SK Team video game. Something that I bet we would probably get if it was real. <laughs> I'm telling you. This did good. This did really good. What's this? New research available. Game tutorials, motor sound. Nice. Uh... You're not doing anything. Ooh, do this one. We have enough time? Oh no. This might be a bad one. This might be a bad one. Come on. Come on. Yes. 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 All right. Good. Good. Now, develop a new game. We are killing it. All right. We have a new topic. I hope. We're going to try mystery for the first time. Uh, or disasters again. Escape.
custom game engine. Game Power Boy. This is Game Power Boy. Save game. We have enough for everything. But that's what we're gonna do. Game from the city. Have came in. Oh, what what's going on back there? Ooh. Alright. And we got eight. And another eight. And another eight. Let me guess. Oh, we got seven. Okay. I thought we were gonna get another eight. But we didn't. We're doing okay. We're doing okay. Escape from the City is doing very well. The SK Team video game, though, is probably one of the favorite games I've made. I mean, look at this. Look at this. You're not gonna get anywhere. You're not gonna get anywhere near those cells. Unless you make the SK Team video game. I mean, you could probably get more. I mean, you never know. <laughs> or you will just get, like, one copy. That's coming from me. Alright. So we're making... We're making the game engine. Let's do this. We're getting some fans from Escape from the City. That's good. I also like how we named it after a song. Recent studies suggest that the industry variety of gaming devices also in the market as specialized games. Some platforms become more popular with younger games. Ooh, okay. As more and more developers enter the market, we expect developers to focus their games on specific age groups. Congratulations, your first custom game engine is now ready. You should try using it uh, in your next game. New research topic. Alright, uh, okay. Let's develop a new game. Ew. Now we can pick. Now we can pick some other stuff. Uh, let's go back. Let's go back to time travel. Uh, running in the nineties. Why am I naming my games after songs? I don't know. I like it. It's just funny to me. All right. So it will be an adventure game. Since you're in time travel. And it will be for the TES. That's right. We're using the game power. Boy. Alright, let's do it. Ooh. We could go for this. We'll stick to this one for now. Look at Escape from the City. It's doing very well. Alright, so the engine needs to be good. And so does the story. I think the engine doesn't need to be as good as the story. That's all I'm aware of. There we go. There we go. We're gaining some stuff from this. I think we're going to make this game and then we're going to end the episode. If you guys like this game and you want me to do more, just tell me. Um. Alright, so... We need the dialogue to be good. The artificial intelligence can be a bit down. Let's try that. Alright. Following the mass success of the TES console, there are now rumors. Oh, Vena, or as everybody knows them as. That is right, Sega is jumping into the market. And now we're going to have a war. Where's the Atari at? Now we can have a massive gaming explosion. But to be honest, I'm pretty sure it's a good thing they skipped over the Atari. Because, I mean, there's not really much I would do with the Atari. I mean, the Atari, I'm not saying the Atari is the bad system. It depends on which t Atari you're talking about. Because after the two that we got, the two last ones, when Nintendo and Sega were already blowing up, yeah, Atari just died off. I mean, Atari just died off. It's sad, but it's true. Uh, world design, graphic, sound. I think we can tone down the graphic. There we go. Doing some work. Doing some work. Yes. Beautiful. Alright. Now I want to see this. What happened? Oh. Okay, we got a new best again. We got 12 this time. That's okay with me. What's this? Escape from the city is now off the market. Nice. Alright. Oh, we got the first game review, so let me check them out, and then we'll end the episode. The first review is for our newly... Release game running in the 90s <laughs> came out. Oh my goodness. 
I like it. I'm glad you like running in the 90s. Is it a new way of life for you? Alright, let's go. Let's go. We got sixes on the board. Seven, a good game. Alright. No tens yet. We haven't hit... Oh, very enjoyable. It wasn't as enjoyable as the SK Team video game. Uh, Nintendo. This could be a thing. But anyway, guys, I think that's going to wrap it up. Our last game we've made is Running the Night. Today, Venna has confirmed recent rumors about a new gaming console and announced the Master V, or as everyone knows it, as the... Wait. Is that even a... Is, I'm trying to think. Is that even a Genesis? I mean, Sega has so many consoles. It looks nothing like a Dreamcast. It looks nothing like a Saturn. It's probably the Genesis, since it came after the TES. So that's my guess. But okay. Well, guys, I think that's going to wrap it up. We're going to get him to research one more thing. Well, I say thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure you hit that like button and subscribe to the channel if you enjoy these. And tell me if you like this series, because I'm actually liking this game. And we could go all the way to PlayStation. I don't even know if the PlayStation did in this one. I didn't get that far. But make sure you hit that like button, subscribe, and tell me what you think so I know. And without further ado, why am I saying this? I'm just ready to end this. Uh, peace.